A picture of a young homeless boy in Stockton is sparking reaction from the community and beyond. The photo shows the boy sitting in dirt, as you can see, at a homeless camp. But it looks like to many that he's living in a third world country. CBS 13's Angela Masalam is live in Stockton with more for us. Angela? Yeah, Tony Christine, it's certainly a chilling photo that's brought a lot of concern from the community. And we just spoke with Stockton police uh, just a few minutes ago, and they tell me this case is now under investigation by CPS. Meet five year old Suki Wiggum, a young homeless boy just trying to make the best out of his situation. But Suki was pictured here on Wednesday sitting in the dirt at a homeless camp, which looks more like a refugee camp in a war torn country. I ended up with no job, no home, just like that. Anthony Wiggum tells CBS 13 it was all downhill after his home burned down and he lost his job at the old Stockton City Hotel. The primary goal is to find a home, a stable environment for him to be raised. The five year old isn't going to school, Wiggum says, and this camp is his daycare while his dad picks up side jobs. And I left him here with someone who's been watching him before. And she was in her tent with, I don't know what she yelled, but that was enough for them to call the police. That was Wednesday when this photo of Suki was taken. Wiggum says he was detained and released. I'm going to keep him fed and I'm going to keep him happy and living a normal as possible life. Karma's going to come around and switch them kids up and take them to safety. Lewis Little Wolf says he's shocked by the number of homeless children out on the streets. A volunteer with a local shelter, Little Wolf says the children are often living in subpar conditions. Well, what I would like to see is, is, is CPS come in and do a walkthrough. We reached out to CPS on Thursday asking at what point can the agency step in, but it wouldn't comment. With winter just a few months away, we wanted to know if Wiggum had any immediate plans to get little Suki some shelter. Or if I have to build something out of plywood, I'm going to keep my son warm. Certainly a lot of opinions about this case. And we just found out Wiggum and his young son have been taken in by a concerned community member. But again, interesting to see how this plays out now that CPS is investigating this case. Absolutely. Angela Masalam live in Stockton Forest tonight. Angela, thanks. New at five.